Welcome to today's video. Welcome to today's video. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today is Sunday, and I'm having a riding lesson today. Hopefully, hopefully it works out. We booked the arena. It should all work out. These guys are supposed to leave at noon. My car should be back by noon. It should all work out. Cross your fingers, guys, that it all works out because I'm excited <laughs> to have a lesson. Oh, dear. Let's see what you're doing there with the pickles, dude. Hey, can we get for Why don't you take the whole bottle of pickles up to Sophie? Okay. okay? Don't drop them. Or did they break? Yeah. Pickles do break. Jacob and I were sitting on the couch eating pickles. Sam's away with the, dealing with the car. And terrible things have happened so far this morning. Terrible things. The puppies woke me up this morning. The power. We did not know, but there's a scheduled power outage from 8 a.m. till noon. 8 a.m. So that means brushing your teeth with no water. It means brushing your hair with no electricity. Gabby just complained. There's nothing to do. Like, there's nothing to do. I lost my phone. I asked Gabby to phone it so that I could find it. And she's like, duh, we have no power. I'm like, duh. Me and my sister are down. Crazy times, you guys. Kids, messes, horses, dogs, and no power. It's just crazy. Jacob is super concerned over the fact that our boy-girl to dog ratio, boy-to-girl dog ratio, is skewed to the girls. He keeps on looking for a boy dog in our house. And once he finds Toby, he's excited that he's a boy, huh? Too many girls in our family? Um, is he a boy? Is he a boy? They're all girls. Wow. Except for him. Oh, there's only one? Only one. And he's no boy. Yeah, he's a girl. No one's a boy. No one's a boy. You? There, there, there's three boys. That's right, three boys. Um, Is I'm, I coming riding with us or not? No. Um, 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 there, there, there's a dog boy. I'm the boy, and I'm the boy. Right. Guys, this is driving me insane. Yeah, yeah, no, no, we're gonna do There's no power everywhere. There's no power until noon. It's 11.30. Their parents are coming soon to pick them up. We have power, guys. I didn't realize, can the car still drive? Yeah, because it goes on gas. No. Yeah, it does. You're not. See? So. Power's on. Jacob found the light. So basically this is what it's going to be like, tacking up our ponies in the dark because it's so cold outside. How cold is it? How cold is it? 12. 12 degrees. It's chicken so Are we riding inside today because it's so cold? Yeah, it's so cold. We're going to close the arena door. It's freezing. Okay. Winter happened, you guys. We were sleeping, the power went out, and winter happened all in one day. I have been missing our horses, like, I'm sad we haven't been there. I'm sad we haven't been there to see them, but sometimes you have to take a break from horses and spend time with your beloved grandchildren. Right? With funny noses. <laughs> She's looking at you like, what the heck? I don't think she wants to be riding. You don't think she wants to be ridden? tired. Oh no, she can do a lot more than what you've been doing with her. Gentle, gentle. She, in the olden days, she was a lesson horse, and she taught lots of kids how to walk, trot, and canter, and jump. Right, this is how you take care of horses in the dark. You use Gabby's phone, and you... Um, ma'am? Yeah. You pull a light. We need to get some flashlights for our barn. Problem is, batteries die in winter. Uh, Gracie's smelly hooves are gone now that the farrier has come. You ready to ride, sister? So today's lesson is all about steering. Are you excited? <laughs> are you scared? Nana's gonna be riding Storm and he's a big horse. So you know what great Gab Sophie's doing? She's training her so that she can pull a cart. So maybe in the summer when you're here next time, in the summer, she'll be ready and we'll sit in a little cart and she'll pull us around. What do you think of that? Fine. That's what she's practicing. And I actually found a cart to buy. I just have to figure out how we're going to go get it because it's far away. All right, so she is up and she is going to be learning to, I thought you were going to hold a, a lead rope. Oh, the bit's a little small? Oh, I see what you're saying. You just can't get out of it. 
Good girl. Wow, good job. Look at how good our pony is. But actually, you should be teaching her how to use her legs instead of the reins. Basics are basics are bodies. Look at that gorgeous butt. Look at that gorgeous butt. I love having my grandkids here, especially for a whole entire weekend. We get to do a lot of things. But man, I am tired. Brooklyn? Brooklyn's totally in charge right now. Look at that good pony. Wow, she just squeezed and asked her to go. That's amazing, Brooklyn. What the heck? You're steering. Uh oh, the reins are a little loopy. Wow! Did you ask her to walk or did she just start? Good girl, steer to Nana. Look at you guys, we got an independent rider. It was bound to happen, cause your heart. I love up a hill. What? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Jacob just picked up a rock. But it wasn't a rock. <laughs> and when I told him it was horse poop, the look on his face was so funny. I hope you make it. Cause I can't change it anyway. God, what a good dog. All right, so it's time for, aw, aw, thank you for kissing my hip. That's awesome. Bye. I love you. Say goodbye to our friends. Say bye, friends. Bye, friends. Bye, Brooklyn. No, she's going with you. Bye, Jacob, say bye, friends. Bye, friends. Look at the camera. Bye, friends. Aw, he's giving you all a hug. I hear it, Do you have a no, can you grab it for me? You, it's your horse. I just want to see where they are. Aww. Of course, the one I'm riding is not here. <laughs> I think it's a text over in that big. Okay. Best friends, three amigos. All right. All right, big guy. Don't worry, I'm not riding you unless, unless I do ride you. I might try it. I might try it. Yeah, Gavin's just saying. Other horses, you need the. You need to ride the other horse. He's so literally, ride, so he's ride. literally such a good beginner horse. Like Storm is a school horse for sure, even though he's never been a school horse. 
he won't like being a school horse, but he's good for it. Yeah, he wouldn't like it probably. He doesn't like it when he gets ridden so much. I appreciated that, Storm. Thank you. Did you feel he was moving forward? Like usually when he gets his pads, Reese? Yeah. Okay, because once he gets his um, he feet done. Um, you put his head down. Yeah, I saw him putting his head down. Good boy. Could Good boy. Feel a on his back? Yeah, he's like. He's like, don't ever let her ride me again. I see why I need new stirrup leathers. Okay guys, see why she needs them. Before mom rode, my stirrup leathers, this part was right here. So the end part was right here. It's Everybody really- stretches out my stirrup It's leathers. really soft leather. Like, yeah, I'm it's really soft. soft. It's just All right, thick. take that off and I'll take him out. Um, the thickness so is keeping it from breaking. Ben got excited because he wanted me to ride him today. Good. And I told him I was, and he turned around from eating hay just so I can put this on. Yeah, so did Chino. They're both excited. They're like, you haven't been here for two days. They did it faster. All right, you guys, if uh, the girls are getting ready to ride, I'm gonna take Storm out. I rode Storm in a lesson. Yeah, it was a lesson. And uh, I suck at, at lesson horse. Like, I suck in lessons. I do so much better on the trail. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, but if you wanna see my lesson, it's probably already up if you missed it. Storm was amazing for me after, after Coach Gabby got him. What's the matter? Is it bugs biting you? It's almost not bug season. Ticks came to, to get Storm. Isn't that nice? Do you guys remember when Tex and Storm were in the same field and they were BFFs? Tex. Aww. Look at that. Well, you know you're good friends when you share the water fountain together. Oh, I love that they're best friends again. Uh oh. They're frenemies. Goodbye, handsome. He's just going over. Where are you going? Got the whole thing to himself. Nothing on earth will ever make me feel any different. I think that the setup here is so beautiful, so amazing, so incredible. I love, like, Gabby wants to, somebody moved out and Gabby wants to take their, they had like their own little tiny field for their own horse. Gabby's like, I want that field. I'm like, no way, our horses love the big field. You gotta clean off Gino's legs. Oh, I have to clean off Gino's legs? Yeah. Is that my payment? Is that my payment for your lesson? All right. All right, I will do it. I literally just spent 25 minutes cleaning all four of, all, eight horses feet the bell boots i cleaned all the inside i cleaned the outside a little bit it's kind of dried on there but i cleaned all the inside so it's not muddy underneath there and this boy loved it you guys like his head was almost on the ground he just stood there with his neck hung all the way down almost sleeping while i got all the mud off of his feet and then i did this guys and this guy hates his feet messed with like hates it and he stood still and just let me do it. Like, he was excellent. Okay, we're going to the tech store this week because we yeah. finally have time. And we are going to look for the bright size bit for him. This is a tiny bit big. Look at those feet. You may not think they look that good, but they were covered in dried on, caked on mud. Finn. Finn, let her do it. I'm trying not to mess this up, Mom. Oh my gosh. Dad, stop. I get excitement. I get butterflies in my stomach when I see the kids walk in. Walk in with their beautiful ponies. And I can't believe it took me like 40 minutes to clean. It took me 25 minutes to clean both their feet. You scratched my salad. I better get on. He's going forward. Oh, these are so long. And these are on a whole higher than what I ride Chino with. Sorry. I don't know if half my problem riding Storm is the fact that it's got a different kind of saddle. Like, I don't know if the Pasofinos are like the saddle. Like, never, I've ridden in a couple of different saddles there. Love them both. And in the, the English saddle, I feel like I'm perched somehow. Like, I don't feel like I can sit the proper way. And in the Western saddle, you just sit there and it puts you in the right position, I feel like. Okay, so what I like. What do you like? Barn area when I'm packing up, he only poops in the arena. Yeah. Or in the field. Yeah. I Good love boy. It, then I don't have to clean it up. Yeah. Awesome. I'm so I'm watching Sophie with her hands. 
Wait till she comes around again. See Sophie's hands? That's what she's saying I should have put my hands like. That the bit does fit him, they had it on wrong. Hey. Remember, not that long ago, she was afraid to ask him to canter. Soon I'll be saying, Remember that time when she was afraid to jump Phil? Remember that time she was afraid to jump verticals? We'll forget that she was even afraid. He hasn't been ridden for two days. So if I get on him, he's gonna walk around like at a normal speed? Yeah. I gotta get on him. Yeah. Just when you're done. Oh, that was super fast. We have to close the door before we leave. Super fast. Girls just did flat today. It's a miracle. Stormy's in. I had a ride on him. Finney's in. Sophie was not happy to just do flat, but we I decided we're having a lesson with Brandon this week, and then we have a show this week. And we're seeing yeah, my horse this week. I'm jumping back to then as I can. Uh, yeah, you do need to, so we'll come back tomorrow and you can jump. Good night, Chino Bambino. Good night, guys. Good night, Tex. Oh, we have to close the door. Yay. Good girl. Okay. That's a lot of food. Yeah, that's a lot of food. Sophie's gonna draw today's winner. Okay, so just scroll. Don't pick somebody. I want to read the comments to see who has it next You can't do that. That's mm -hmm. not fair. I refuse to do that because everybody is kind and everybody has amazing comments and I don't want to choose like that way. I just want it to be a completely it has to random. Load. I want it to be a completely random thing. And that's why I didn't put that we're doing our giveaways in our title. Because I want it to be the people who watch us all the this time one. to win. Okay. Olivia Valero. Olivia Valero, you win. The giveaways are so generous and so fun too. I can't wait for the day when Brooklyn really gets comfortable with Gracie. I feel like they will do awesome things together. How cool would it be if Brooklyn was the next little hunter jumper girl in the family? That would be amazing, Olivia. Email me or Instagram me your address and I will ship out your socks and your pop socket from Halter Equestrian. Thanks so much for playing along. It has been awesome. I love your comments. All the other winners have messaged me except for K Productions. K, if you're watching, can you message me because you won some treats and I want to send them out this week. Ready for today's giveaway. Today is another treat giveaway from a completely different company. Two of you are going to win Martin's treats. Look how big this bag is, you guys. We have two of them. We have one, two. They are both apple flavor. Both apple flavor. They are four kilograms, 8.8 .8 pounds of horse treats, you guys. And we want to give these away to two lucky viewers. Thank you so How much, treats Martin's Treats. Go ahead, follow them on Instagram. Where did it go? 
Uh, you could even follow them on Facebook, probably. Go ahead, follow them. This is their sign. This is their logo. Go ahead and follow them on Instagram or Facebook. Come back and comment done. And later today, we will pick two winners. Good luck, guys. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the way